Hello, spring here, part four. Um, more mesh, of course. Don't like the gaps. More boards. I'll uh, explain what they're for in a bit. And I need to get this unloaded because any minute now I've got a ton of ballast coming down here, being dumped here, and then I've got to get it from here to there across the Great Divide so see you in a bit okay this is gonna go something like that I'll have to take it all out put the concrete in first and put it in in the layers but uh, as uh, Marty my mate Volgnit said I think I'll be able to drive a tank across that cheers Marty Just as the delivery is about to arrive, <laughs> it started chucking down. Uh, it's all right, because I don't think I'm doing this concreting until tomorrow. I've got a full day on it. Uh, those boards there, I need to rip down the middle to make the, so I've got the boards for tamping it. And I've got to take the gates off and whatnot. So, all good fun. Right, I've ripped through my boards. That's my 10 foot saw tamper, and that's my 6 foot 6 saw tamper. So uh, it's all good prep. Right, I've now got to get that from there to here somewhere. I'm trying to work out where's the most comfortable place for mixing. I think if I put the ballast there and the mixer here, then I can shovel into the mixer. The mixer spins round, so it will pivot into the barra or whatever. So that looks like a plan. So I shall get that from there to here. I'll take the gates off. And I've uh, just chopped down that with my reciprocating saw because. Uh, that would have been too low for the concrete and move the drop bolt. I had to move it all up that way a bit. So, all good fun. Okay, uh, phone went completely flat. So, I managed to move all the ballast from out there to there. Got the cement mixer sorted. First load in there. Um, I've cut it in half. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do the first half. Um, this steel in here is just holding the this side of that bit of wood up. Uh, so I've got a layer to go in. Some of this steel is going in the other side. Uh, anyway, I'm going to get on with it. The phone needs charging. It's uh, dying to death. So I'll see you in a bit. All right, quick update. Um, I'm about just over half full on this. Still got that thing whirring away. Um, I'm going to crack on. And then I'll see if I've got enough of that to do this half. I'm not sure at the moment. Well, stick of the dump moved in. <laughs> I've got that all concreted. Um, and then it absolutely pissed down. So we have tarpaulin connected to car <laughs> over that tied to the fence post <laughs> tied to parasol wheelie bin <laughs> um, wheelbarrow <laughs> with weight on the wheelbarrow <laughs> oh what a laugh on my weather app it didn't say anything about rain whatsoever, otherwise I wouldn't have even started today. I know I had a little shower earlier when I was setting up, which should have warned me. But anyway, managed to get this up in time. Uh, it dripped through a little bit, so I refloated it, and then I th it was starting to come through in places, and ruining the finish. And I was having a bit of a flap, and then I thought, ah, gate panels. So after I put all this up and then I had to drag them through and <laughs> lay them. Good job that crappy 
crappy um, raised bed piece of rubbish was there because uh, it's just perfectly uh, angled that for getting the rain off. Um, I don't think I've got enough ballast to do this side and I've got like twice as much cement as I need but that's okay because it's the uh, the stuff in the heavy plastic bags that keeps so I'm gonna have to order another half a ton of ballast tomorrow I think I don't think this is gonna it might be close but it's no good being close is it so anyway that's it for today and uh, I'm gonna properly check the weather for tomorrow before I do this bit so thanks for watching see you later I've been Springy.